different, I am going to give you guys the ultimate Notion tour. Oh, I have a little treat for y'all that I'm really excited to share. Hey everybody, welcome to this week's video. Um, we're doing a different one this week, uh, something a little different. I am going to give you guys the ultimate Notion tour. And I say that, I say that, I know I sound a little, sound a little extreme, right? My work in Notion is my masterpiece. It's my baby. And I have been working my butt off to make myself the most beautiful template to start the school year and to start my new job and keep up with here, YouTube, and all those things in my business. So, and personal life. But here I am giving y'all the tour and I have a little treat for y'all that I'm really excited to share. So, thank y'all so much for watching, and I hope y'all enjoy. Oh, this is so fun. Also, little note, this isn't the video I plan on posting this week. At all. <laughs> uh, hopefully it'll come out next week. But, this week, like, two days ago, my laptop broke. The hin If you follow me on Instagram, you'll notice. The hinge on my laptop, from what we can tell, seized, and it just, it just killed over so we had to thank god for prote protection plans if you're a student get a protection plan i know it's like an extra hundred bucks but it's so worth it <laughs> um so they're sending it to whatever place they need to send it to see if they can fix it or if i just need a whole new laptop praying i need a whole new laptop because how on god's green earth are they gonna fix that but yeah I don't have my laptop right now, which is like the main thing I edit on and the main thing I was using to film that video. I mean, I wasn't filming on my laptop, but I was using my laptop as part of the video. So it kind of changed my plans for how I was going to post the video that I had planned this week. So now we're doing this and I'm kind of excited to do this. It's something I've been wanting to do for a while and we're going to get into it. <sighs> okay. Welcome to the notion. Um, let me, it was giving you a little hint, a little surprise. I'm gonna close this. Okay, welcome to the notion. We're here, we're doing it. We're having big, big things, big moments. Um, I'm gonna give you all a little tour. So this is my homepage, if y'all can't tell. Um, it's super cute, super, oh, I don't know what the girlies are saying. I think like super cute, super demure. Um, so yeah, it is super cute. Now, mind you, everything looks like it's a little to the left and that is because it totally is because it's made to fit my laptop. So we're going to squeeze it this way because I, I use Notion like I just look at my weekly view on my desktop. Um, usually I have my laptop next to me with it open. It's just how life has been lately. So this is my desk, uh, my homepage. It's got the weather. In my area, see it's 92 degrees. Um, it's got a cute little picture of me and my sister. Um, cute little, my neighbor, or this is from uh, Spirit Away clip. And then calendar, year counter, or book counter. When school starts, it starts in a day and 11 hours. Hmm. And then this is a counter to the end of the year because I have a video coming up about goals. Mm. Excited for y'all to see that. <laughs> so let's let's get into it. Let's get into the nitty gritty. Let's get to what you want to see. Now, some things are gonna be blurred for like privacy sake. Um, so I'm sorry about that. And I say blurred, I'll probably just put a big image of my cat. So here's the week view. This week's been a little crazy. <laughs> I didn't get everything done today. Um, oh, I did. I did do the dishes in the morning though. So you know, that's cool. Pardon. So yeah, I've barely gotten anything done this week. Well, I've been at work like all week. But this is what my week queue usually looks like. I'll show you like a clear one in a minute. But this is what it looks like right now. Um, you'll notice they don't line up perfectly and that's just something I've had to let go. <laughs> I wanted it to 
and it just it wasn't it was not working some weeks are heavier than others and that's just how life is and then you go down and you get my morning routine and my night routine and my habit tracker so i'm going to change this over here in the corner where it says dates i'm going to make it um sorry pop up i'm going to make it like monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday because i know you can select them and like click them all to be gone so like see you can like big select and it would okay i know it works sometimes <laughs> And this is my weekly one. So if I finished artwork, um, I shower, I wash my hair like every four days. So uh, make sure I wash my hair, finished a book, and started watching a new show. I am terrible at watching TV. I know it's like a weird thing to be bad at, but I am. Um, and yeah, for my daily, daily drawing, daily reading, vitamins, walked 10k steps. Haven't gotten there. Um, an exercise and then here is my important dates so this is like everything that's like coming up soon most of the time it will be like due dates for school projects so I have my social media planner which shows all of my videos and stuff that need to be filmed and whatnot um, my work schedule so like the days I'm working again important dates um, this is just general school work so like if one day I need to read 100 pages of a textbook. I'll have it written down um, in like class hours and stuff. And then this is my workout routine. And then this one I'm kind of thinking of deleting because it isn't very helpful and it's my chore chart. I actually edited it, edited it. Um, I added a chore section on the to-do list. And I feel like that works a little bit better because I have some daily chores. I, I don't know if you can see him behind me. He's like chilling over here. I've got this cat. This cat right here, I think his butt is facing the camera. And I gotta do his cat litter like every other day. Preferably every day, but every other day at the moment. And I gotta do dishes and I gotta work out. And work out is a chore. Don't argue with me on that. Um, <laughs> but I have a new week button, which will, if I just click it here to show you, set up a whole new week. Um, I, For me, I auto put in my chores because I kind of have myself on like a calendar um, so every single day of the week I'm supposed to do a round of dishes um, and you know I live in a house with my family obviously uh, and dishes are something that we use a lot of so I'm trying to be helpful and do the dishes um, but yeah dishes the day I have laundry all that jazz so this is what a clear one would look like so that's what a clear one would look like. And if I wanted to, I could hit the move button and move it to like an archive page, but I'm not really worried about that. So I just delete it. Um, I do also keep a paper planner. So if something's like really important that I need to get done, it'll be on there anyways. Um, so this is my week view. I love it. Very cutesy. Um, I have a little picture of Senshi. I also, this button sets up a new, my phone just vibrated sets up a new morning routine which is very important so yeah that is the week view let's go into the month view she's important she's gonna have a lot of things i don't know she might be a little blurred so the month view just has a calendar here i don't look at the month view often notion opened up notion calendars and and that's my holy grail notion calendars mwah, love them so that is what I usually focus. This is kind of just like a quick to get to my Notion calendar. And then I have extra tasks. So like things I've been wanting to do, but like I haven't gotten to and, or they won't, they're not something like I'm really pushing to get done. So clean up my Google photos, um, call a local comic book store, trim the dog's nails or something that's like not technically my job, but like someone's gotta get it done. Film a sticker tutorial. Uh, make cute little pillows for my bed. That's one. Um, and then here I also have a link to my budget tracker, which I haven't used in a while. So my budget tracker, I got it from some other Notion tour. I, I, I watch Notion tour videos a lot and I can't remember who I got it from. So yeah, <laughs> um, 
and I'm not really gonna show you that because it's like my expenses and stuff and it's a little personal. So yeah, but it's there. Next, oh, my health tracker. So these, so I have my planner and I have my hubs. My hubs are kind of, oh, I keep getting this thing popping up. My hubs are kind of like special topics that I wanna like be able to click to and like look at a wide view of. So yeah, my hubs are for looking at like main topics, big. So let's go to the health one or what I like to call Senji's glow up plan. Um, if you can't tell, I fell down a dungeon meshy rabbit hole and am now worried about my health and what I eat. So this has what should be my workout plan. Really bad at sticking to it. Um, healthy snacks, cause um, I wanna make sure I get my fiber. Um, this is just a blank thing that says meals, meals ideas this week. Healthy facts with how many grams of fiber, how many calories we're supposed to get. Um, and then this says gut health and there's nothing there because I haven't put anything there. And then I have some uh, workout videos that I found on the internet um, that I just have all saved. This is a hub for my workout plan. This is some TikToks I've saved for like wrist, wrist stretches because as an artist, my wrist always hurts. Um, some weights and yeah, more wrist, wrist pain videos. And then I have a recipe area over here, but like it's basically empty. So yeah, this is kind of a little bland, a little blank. I kind of just go to it if I like need an idea of what to do or if I'm scheduling my workouts because my workouts, I'll have this and it'll be like jump rope 50, 50. So, you know, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And then a link to a um, YouTube video that I want to do, you know, so this is like a tension yoga. So that's my health page. It's pretty cute. I got, obviously it's Dungeon Meshi themed if you can't tell. And then we have my school page, which is probably gonna be very blurred. Um, look at my header. It's a great picture of Toby. Um, you're probably asking yourself, Emily, like, why are you blurring all these things? And that's cause it is private information, but I wanna show it to you to get you guys like a good idea. So this here is my schedule um it's got little time blocks of everything and like when i have classes and then it has a section for online classes so i use that then i have um my course schedule which is just a link to this uh, table right here so yeah i have this this table which has assignments their due dates uh their status um, what class they are and then like if it was an art project I would have it like in um, yeah here um, I have due soon due this week uh, due date passed and it's green because like I would keep track of them but like you know obviously I'd have it if it's done or not and I would put in if the due date has passed and I've gotten it done this over the year will get very full over the school year because I like to be able to look back and see where I am with my things. And then I have this, which I don't really use anymore. Um, this is a to-do list specifically for homework. Um, in my old Notion page, it was helpful, but in this one, it's not really. Then I have a money tracker, which um, tracks like how much I have in my school account um, and like my financial aid and loans and stuff, which I need to update for the semester. Um, and then I have my own person. Okay. We're going to look at this. Um, I have my own personal little Emily school of art, which is just full of YouTube videos. I'm trying to find one with the YouTube video. It's just full of YouTube videos. I'm supposed to watch to become the ultimate artist. And then this is my degree tracker, which basically has what classes I need to be taking. Um, it's got my curriculum core that's provided on my school's website and like if I've completed them or not and stuff like that. Oh, that's gonna need to be blurred. I found my FASFA password. God, I'm a nightmare. Um, so that's my school page. Very simple, nothing really going on here. 
Next, ooh, my business. This one's fun and very blurred. Uh, like this whole side should be blurred right now <laughs> for video ideas because I want to keep it a secret. They're super fun and short content ideas. So this will have my business calendar, which has like things like when I have, um, actually it usually is blank. <laughs> and then I have my social media calendar, which shows when I'm posting videos and what those videos are about. Um, and when I'm filming and then my events calendar has events. Obviously I don't have an event for this month. Then I have my social media hub, which has a blank, a general overview of like when I want to be posting and how important which social media app is. A link to all my socials, some tags, and then another view of my social media planner. Then we have my inventory and future products. This one. I don't remember where I got this from. I think I got it from just like a general notion template. So I have it by product, sticker, print, and B tier. And I'll put in things like how many I have. Let's go to this table. Yeah. I have current inventory, how much it sells for. If I sold all of it, it would be this much. Um, and then inventory needed. Um, if it's a set, I need to work on sold. Because I tried to make a button that like every time I clicked it, it would tell me it sold. But that was a struggle. So yeah, it just is a place for me to see the price tags of everything and all that jazz. Because that's important. Next is my work page. So this is going to, I'm not going to look at this. Um, it just has my work schedule and like links to like websites I need to be able to look at for work. And that is private information, so I can't share it. I also don't want to get in trouble with my employer. So yeah, it just imagine it just has my schedule and then like a few links to my email. Yeah, <laughs> just close your eyes. Next, fun page, goals page. This page, oh, there's gonna be a whole video about this page as well. Um, we got big money moves, big business goals. Um, cute little pictures of Fallon. Again, this is made on my laptop, so it's a little skewed to the left for some reason. Um, health goals, learning goals. And then these, uh, this is like when the month ends again. Um, and then these are little personal pages um, about building a Cobb house, because that is something I would love to do in the future. Um, New Year's goals, personal random stuff. Um, and then fixing my bedroom, which is just a mood board for my bedroom. So yeah, this page is a little blank, a little bland, but let's just say I have the door covered and stuff. <laughs> Again, gonna be a video in the future. Keep your eyes out for that. Um, fun stuff. This is a really good one. So this one is actually a gallery table, which is something I don't normally do, but I wanted it to be like pretty and colorful. Um, so this one is just full of fun stuff. Uh, it's got girls nights, pookie nights, and it has some ideas of what I would love for us to do. Then physical media I'd want to own. Um, stuff I need to watch. Like seriously, I've got like the rest of Young Justice, Scott Pilgrim, Harley Quinn Show, Jujutsu Kaisen, Batman, Hush, One Piece, Dragon Prince, Black Clover, My Hair Academia. Don't ask questions you don't want the answers to. Um, the Midnight Gospel, Gospel, Neon Genesis, Hunter x Hunter. Blood of Zeus, Smiling Friends, Suicide Squad, Ika, I Iskia, I can't remember how to pronounce it, My Adventures of Superman, All of Adventure Time, Chainsaw Man, Soul Leader, Our Flag Means Death, The Last of Us, The Righteous gem Gemstones. It's a lot. Again, I'm bad at watching TV. Books I want to buy. Um, and currently it just has all of Dungeon Meshi because I need to add to it. Um, my D&D hub, you can't see that because... I don't want to spoil any of my game, the people that are playing. Um, plots and ideas, again, that's a little personal. Um, this is my Christmas gift hub. I'll show you this. Um, oh, it's, oh, why, why is it? Oh God, what, just full wit. Um, <laughs> so this, um, these gifts have been given to their peoples. Um, I'm gonna block this side. Um, <laughs> so that you don't see like who I'm giving it to. So it has like status if it's done or not. Um, things I need to buy to make it when it's needing to be given. So like if I don't see a family member until like January so I can have a little extra time. And if the gift has been um, 
if it's in progress and when it's wrapped. So yeah, if a gift is wrapped or not, I keep it on there. My foot is asleep and it tingles really bad. Um, next is computer build. Uh, the PC that I'm recording on right now, I really want to upgrade mostly so I can play Baldur's Gate. But... <laughs> this is terrifying. I don't know half the words being used. Um, I have some videos uh, that I would like to do. Okay, so here's the PC, the plan build around the graphics card you want. Um, which is right. Baldur's Gate requirements. Best PC builds for gaming in 2024. Um, and then a few links to a few products. Um, I'm gonna go deeper into this at some point. Currently, I don't have the money to build a new PC, um, but it's something I do want to do because this one is about five years old, I want to say. Um, so it needs a little, it needs a little spruce up. And this is my Ren Faire costume. This is again gonna be another video on its own. I have patterns. Um, I'm. This is what I'm gonna do. And yeah, a lot of these are like video ideas. Um, video game wish list. I really like gaming. Would y'all want to see gaming content? I don't know. I'm pretty boring. But yeah, this is my fun stuff. I enjoy it. Next, crafts. Oh wait, no. The, there's an art club page, which you're probably thinking, what's art club? It's a school thing. So again, not showing you. Um, we're going to crafts. <laughs> so this is like crafts I want to make. Again, things that could be videos. Um, and then recipes I need to write down. I spelled pillow wrong here. We're ignoring that. Um, and some Skillshare classes I'd be interested in. Whew. That was a big one. And then some cute little drawing, or not drawings, some images I have on Pinterest that I'm like, I want to make that. And product, um, crafts in progress. So I'm working on a puff quilt right now and I have a heart bag that I need to finish that's for myself. So yeah, that's this. It's kind of boring, a little bland, but it's like a good place for me to be like, okay, this is the crafts I want to be working on right now. Um, it's kind of like a good place for me to go and see what I want to do. Next, after crafts, we have Toby. Obviously, he is the main theme of this page. It's kind of where I like, again, another page I need to spruce up. It's where I kind of keep his like health stuff. Um, he is. 13 year old 13 years old he just turned 13 august 12th woohoo big birthday um and so i need to like you know he's my baby i gotta take care of him um so things that are good for his diet low carbs something to keep them hydrated cats are chronically dehydrated and then toby hates wet food but it's good for him so i'm gonna ask mom about getting freeze-dried food and then a uh, freeze-dried food that I found. And then again, this big giant picture of Toby. Um, and a few things I wanna buy for him. And then this is the page when we got Gizmo. I just kinda keep it for like memory's sake. Here's the best image of Gizmo I've ever taken. It's when we first got him and we needed to give him a bath because we needed to make sure he didn't have fleas and he didn't. First cat we bathed that didn't have fleas. Toby didn't have fleas, but he had ringworm. He was dramatic like that. Um, <laughs> so again, this is just like a health hub for Gizmo. Um, here were some of his name ideas. I really feel like we should have named him Gambit. I'm stealing that for future cats. Um, <laughs> God, I'm a tiny genius. Um, but yeah, this is a great picture of Gizmo. My mom's holding him. He's dripping wet. I'm actually gonna print this and put this on my desk. Um, Gizmo health facts, he should be fixed around, this is just when he was eight weeks old, February 10th, he should be fixed in May, food wise, he should move to cat food around January or December, on December, the next January or December, I can't read, um, what we need, I want to keep him, at the moment we didn't know if we were going to, obviously, we did, he's a tiny terror, um, so yeah, that's the cat page. And then this art ideas is just a um, drop down where I just put in ideas I have that I need to organize later. So yeah, 28 minutes, that's my notion. 
let me show you the cool things. Oh, let me show you another page that I really love that hopefully in the future I will be sharing with y'all. Um, this is the art career and future page. Um, it's one I'm working on. Uh, I need, I'm going to blur out this corner with the big school on it because it has some schools that I'm thinking of going to. And again, privacy. Art literature, I need to put stuff here. <laughs> but these, these images, the center scroll is videos that I have collected and a syllabus I've made for myself um, for people to follow in 16 weeks. So I have this one for Blender. This is an illustration one where I've collected videos on illustration. And it also goes into um, art portfolios and picture books. Then I have one on animation. I think I only made this one, yeah. So this is just a five week one, which is just a mini, like I wanna have a general knowledge of animation. So, this is that page. Then pixel art. I want to learn how to do pixel art. Uh, so I think I could learn it in three weeks. So I'm prob I'm probably very like ambitious about that. So <laughs> take that with a grain of salt. Next. Oh, I have a zine class. I love zines. So five weeks of learning how to make like fun zines. Cause I think zines are cool. And I think we should all be making zines. So yeah, this is a page that I've been wanting to finish and uh, bring to y'all. But I haven't had time. It's something I want to work on. I'm trying to decide how exactly I want to do it because it's like a collection of other people's videos. So I obviously think I would make it um, free or pay what you want. Um, because, you know, I did put time in it. But it's a collection of other people's videos. And I need to like go through it myself <laughs> to make sure it like actually works. So this is a work in project progress and I'll show you another work in progress. Just a little, a little thing. This is the Memily art business, business research page. This is something I've been working my butt off on, but I haven't gotten very far. So this one, um, it's kind of a tool that I'm making for y'all. So I have resources. Um, just, just a bunch of stuff and it's something I'm working on and it's something I hope to bring to y'all soon, but I don't know when. <laughs> so we will see where that takes us. Now is the part that y'all have been waiting for. I copied my notion page to bring to y'all. <laughs> uh, obviously here on my desktop it looks a little funky a little weird it needs to be stretched out here it's stretched out here i don't know why this won't center caption alt comments i want this to center can you be in the center align oh there we go center oh why what what god anyways it's being a pain anyways this is where i made a little planner for y'all i basically copied my uh current one but these pages are a little more blank so i have the buttons for y'all to put in your weekly things if you want to make it so that your chores are auto put in you just hit the little edit button and you just fill out the chores and you hit done um, so when every time you click the button, say on Mondays, you need to do your laundry every day. So you edit you know, laundry on Monday. Um, gave y'all your own daily tabs. If you notice mine have emojis and y'all's don't, it's because I was doing this on the key, my desktop keyboard. And because my desktop is a little old, I don't have an emoji button. <laughs> so I can't put emojis on it. So y'all can obviously do that. Um, bed routine again it has it on button if you want to edit it all just click edit button 
um, and I made y'all an important dates tab. If you want to add any other calendars that you make, just click this button and uh, do an empty view and it should auto put in a new calendar option. So yeah, I got your weeklies. Here we've got your month view, which is just a calendar with extras. You obviously can put in a budget planner of your choice. I got that budget planner for someone from someone else and I can't remember who, so I didn't include it because um, I can't give them credit. And then these pages are blank, except for the school page. I let y'all have the school page. It's just, well, that doesn't work. It's just a, there, that's proper. It's just a blank school page. So y'all can add your own pages like that. It's just a good thing I've enjoyed. Again, for the business, this page is blank. All Most of these pages are blank just because it was hard for me to figure out how to, this needs to be full width, how to get that for y'all. And I definitely believe in like y'all being able to add what you want. If y'all want my view done over, I'm gonna have to like edit it big time. <laughs> Cause again, it has personal stuff in it, but I have this general view and it's free. I'm going to put it on my Kofi. Go check it out. It's going to be pay what you want. So you can pay zero dollars or if you want to give me like two bucks, that's fine. It's completely up to y'all. If you want to edit this widget, just go to Inquifi. I'm going to have it linked down below and sign up yourself and put a different calendar widget in because this is for Austin because I just thought it was a good one. Um, so yeah, calendar for y'all. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoy. Also, if you want to change this, you just gotta click change cover. I hope y'all enjoy this calendar and that y'all like having one. Feel free to use it. Steal stuff you like for your own template. That's what I usually do when I get those free calendars. I just take what I want and make it my own. And that is how I've gotten this beautiful baby that I love oh so much. Again, the book thing, it's so good. Mwah. Hope y'all enjoyed. Again, if you all want to use this template, link is in the description on my Kofi. Um, I might also upload it to Notion Creator. I don't really know how that works. We're gonna do some research on that, but it will be on my Kofi. And so it'll just auto take you to the description. You'll get it. Boom, beautiful. I hope y'all enjoyed this video again. Um, feel free to subscribe. I plan on making a lot of bigger videos because for one, I have a job, which means I have a bigger budget. <laughs> and for two, I enjoy productivity videos. So you'll be seeing a lot of me on this like Notion girly pop sort of site. Again, check out my Instagram. It's where I keep y'all up to date with what's happening in my life. And I complain about AI. <laughs> it's something I do. I just, oh. One o'clock in the morning, I see an AI post, I can't shut up. I hate it. But yeah, I'm a painter, obviously. I am going to school for art. And if you are also doing that, or if you're thinking about doing that, I have videos. I am constantly blogging. I wanna make more videos about going to art school. If y'all want that, tell me, please. I can't make y'all videos that y'all want if you don't tell me. I have good ideas, but I don't know if y'all want them. We have some fun videos coming up. I did a um, sew with me video. We're gonna have a video, a little hint hint. It involves Adventure Time and the fact that I've never watched it before. So yeah, hopefully we'll have some sewing, sewing videos. Fall's coming. So we're gonna get some fall videos and who knows, maybe some book videos. Again, thank y'all so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I will see y'all later. Bye.